My name is Jim O'Neill. I discovered this acronym BRICS nearly 16 years ago. And so I was invited here today to be the opening guest speaker for this wonderful conference on the Rising Powers. And it's a great pleasure and honour to have been asked to do it. The Rising Powers and their interdependence with the rest of us and themselves is the most important thing going on in the world. Uh, and so my main point was to make sure that, that people get that that's the case and, and to congratulate the academics involved in it to be even bolder about the sorts of issues that they're going to spend the next two days showing each other and others what they've been working on because it's fantastic. Why is this so important for everybody, particularly for us in the UK, that might not even have any interest in this stuff? Because of these countries getting bigger and bigger economically, China is the most obvious one, and these places are going to shape more and more about what's going on, including, and here's the really important part, indirectly, uh, the job opportunities for our exporters, and with it, the amount of wealth that can be created, particularly in a post-Brexit world, for the rest of us in the UK. So it's, it's crucial. The kind of questions that these guys are pursuing and could do more of going forward, I mean, are, are endless, really. That Do we uh, want some of these emerging powers to have the same standards of domestic governance that, that we think are right? Or should we just let them have their own? Uh, is it really important that they have the same values of democracy that we have? We often think they should, but I'm not entirely sure that that's necessarily right for different places at different stages of development, but that's the sort of thing these guys could explore. So finding uh, the main message points and putting them in an easily understandable frame of reference for non-academics is crucial.